Okay, next mid investment mapping project is going to be Metamorphs. I have prepared some nice canyons and we're gonna run them with Gilded Metamorph Scarabs. This is the most important part of the session. We're gonna unspec all of our harvest stuff and we're gonna spec all of the Metamorph stuff. So we're gonna get double Metamorphs every map, 50% chance for rewards to be doubled and uh, we're gonna have Metamorphs on every map. We're gonna keep the essences, so we're gonna put essence on the map device for 3C. This is just kind of free money and it's nice essence sales in bulk. We're gonna run canyons, which is kind of an expensive map, but we have good favorites, towers and tropical, so map sustain for money shouldn't be an issue. We're gonna put legions on the map because legions are fun and they're extremely cheap. We're gonna put cartos because, you know, maps are good and uh, these are pretty much free. These are 1C each, so it's mostly the metamorphs that matter. I have force rolled two unique bosses on every single one of these maps. It takes an average of 5.5 chaos to force roll double boss on a map. So we did that and I'm gonna run them with the essential watchstones that we did before, just for, you know, some extra essence juice. And uh, yeah, we'll see how much we make from 50 maps as usual. Empty tabs, dump tab, currency tab, fragment tab, why not metamorph washstones? I looked into the metamorph washstones and they seem really bad. They just they just don't seem good. So we're not like hard min maxing. We're also not doing winged metamorph scarabs. You could do winged, but I don't think it's worth the price. These are 5C each, but the wings are 15 to 20C. And as of yesterday, there wasn't even 50 on the market. You could get 50 if you slow bought them over like two days GG, noobs. or something like that. But um, it's one extra itemized sample. I don't think that's worth the 10 to 15 extra chaos. So we're sticking with uh, Gilded. Okay, let's build the bear. Okay, this one's gonna drop a lot of cards. Ready? Watch this. Told you, alluring bounty. C. C. Yeah, don't worry, my <laughs> my PC has this game kind of covered. Oh, yo, is that Cortex? That's Cortex. Nice. I mean, we do have the uh, the synthesis thing, so it's not unlikely that it happens in 50 maps. That's cool. It's like 3 plus X now? 5 X? What? Nice. Oh my god, look at that metamorph flute. Should we do a... We should do a Gazi thumbnail for metamorphs. Wait, which, which way do we need to point? That way. That thumbnail is so good. Wait, for those who don't know, I'll, I'll show because this is very out of context. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Wait, he has like a... He had some guides and then it's like only this thumbnail <laughs> for every video. Wait. And then there was a section when he only <laughs> had this one. is probably Pillars of Eternity because I don't know this and I know the Witcher and the Skyrim songs or the Elder Scrolls stuff so probably Pillars of Eternity Ooh. Eee. Ooh. okay two ancient orbs yo this metamorph that's 50c there is there is businessman levitating that's an emoji. I don't know why, who made that or what's the context of that, but there is a levitating businessman emoji. It's called businessman levitating. <laughs> Across all platforms. <laughs> Apple, Android, <laughs> fucking uh, everywhere. <laughs> businessman levitating. 
Why not level six awakened gems? Listen, man, I'm farming currency for upgrades, okay? I'll upgrade whenever I have time. So far, I've been farming, gambling for people, editing YouTube videos, and then spending some time with loved ones, okay? I will get to upgrades very soon, because now I have like 250 exalts. I will probably double craft some gems. I will probably get some better jewels. I'll probably upgrade my Watcher's Eye. I'll probably find an Empower for 120C, okay? I'll probably die to this boss, because Awakened PoE tree is stuck on my screen and I don't see my HP. I'll probably find a Haunted Mansion map, because uh, this node is just popping off. Well, first time during the project, we only found one brain, so we can't build a second metamorph. This is the first time this happened out of 30 maps. So not very, uh, not very likely, it seems like. I fully cleared the map. There is three monsters remaining, and every map is double boss because I forced rolled two unique bosses on every map, so it shouldn't that shouldn't be an issue. These guys are so tanky. Wait, that's an even better Gazi thumbnail. What the fuck? Wait. <laughs> okay. That's the last guy. Officially, the last metamorph. Ooh. He's dead. Yes. We're done. That was the last in-map metamorph we built. So we'll use this to organize. How many did you obtain? I don't know, we're, we're about to find out. This. Stop. Okay, we got a single eye out of this. Okay, that is, uh, that is just great. <laughs> what the? F I have vendored all the organs that I have, I had too much of. If you vendor three different types of organs, you have a 50-50 of getting either of the two remaining ones. So if I vendor these, I'm either gonna get a liver or an eye. So using this method, I have kind of synced up my organs, except I was missing four livers, four lungs, and five eyes. I bought those from trade, or rather from people from chat, but you can buy organs on TFT too. So 44 full metamorphs ready to be assembled. These are all really juicy. All of these have at least four organs of currency and something else, sometimes multiple currency, essences, fossils, maps, currency shards, the good stuff. Some of the later eyes and livers are not, uh, not great because we just needed those body parts to complete the metamorphs, but most of these are really, really juicy. So we are gonna assemble these and add that to our profits. Last one. No X. God damn. We have uh, ran all the metamorphs and didn't find a single exalt. We didn't find a single exalt in this entire project. The five exalts here came from the Cortex sale. And that's it. Let's sort the loot and price stuff. Map rolling took 5c on average per map. 
to roll the double boss. So that's uh, 250C. Uh, Chisel, 33C. As always, sextants are in. Scarabs were 5C each for Gilded Metamorph, 1C each for Carto, and 1C, 1.5C each, actually less, but let's say 1.5C each for Legion. So 7.5C 7, 5, 7 .5 per Scarab. So 375C for Scarab. So we are at 437C pure profit before excellencing the three tabs. Here we go. I'm taking the snapshot. There is 4,422 chaos in these three tabs. That's pretty nice. Add it up. So we made 4,859 chaos. Let's see, total value, the 5x is the big drop, is uh, 700 of these, is uh, the one Cortex drop. Deafening Essence of Spite, Alluring Bounty, big value, stack decks as well, 1,300 of stack decks, very nice. Uh, Empower drop, Simulacrum Splinters, Maraket Splinters, Burial Medallions, yeah, seems good. So that's across 50 maps is 97 chaos per map how long did it take to run them including the metamorphs today so it took 10 hours to run them so that's 485 c per hour that is one of the highest per hour mid investment mapping project we've done that's 3.2 x per hour damn Metamorphs are pretty juicy. Um, you could juice even more with going Metamorph Watchstones. I didn't. I think the essences are nice. Uh, and a lot of the drops is just raw currency that once you have a big bulk, it's, it's very easy to trade in bulk to Exalts or Chaos. And uh, yeah, they're pretty fun to kill. Big loot explosions. Good stuff.